Michael, first of all, welcome to Stoke City. Thank you. Just sum up your emotions having been appointed the new manager of the football club. I'm delighted to get the opportunity, first of all. Um, you know, having been here just in the last, this morning and arriving last night, it's, uh, I know about the club's history, I know about the club, um, but the facilities are fantastic and I uh, haven't had the chance to meet the players and work with the players today. Like, for me, it's a, a great opportunity. Hey up guys, Harvey SFC here and today it's Barnsley away. Obviously it's Michael O'Neill's first game, but I'm actually confident about this appointment. In the first game of the Michael O'Neill era, now the shot's been hit from a long way in! Oh, 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 has hit a shot to the edge of the centre circle! For goalkeeper Collins on his line to send the away end Barney down the other end! The first goal of the Michael O'Neill era! Oh, what a spectacular effort! Away swing from McLean, what a grandstand finish this has been! In he goes! Michael, what a way to win a game, but you richly deserve that today. Yeah, I think we did. You know, I thought we were a better team throughout the game. Um, we uh, were very good in the first half. Did we have to fight our way back into the game? But that's the character that's needed. You know, that's the character that I believe is in the dressing room. And that's the character, hopefully, as I say, that can help us move up uh, away from the position we're in. And Ince keeps going and could score here. Sits it up instead. And it's an opening goal for Stoke City. Michael, what a fantastic victory. Yeah, great three points. Um, really dog up performance. I don't say it was a great performance because you know I think we, we know we could have been better at times with the ball, but I thought we started the game well um, and created, you know, half chances good and then scored a good goal early in the game. Alan touches it off, chance for a short ball. He's on the line, but it's in the net, and it's Sam Lucas again against the Swans. Lucas corner. Oh, Sam Vokes with a header, and Stoke make the perfect start. Oh, Anderson's header is short. McLean. Oh, Tyrese Campbell. Wow. Oh, the cross swung in, and it's forced in at the far post by Danny Bart. This is Lucas. Perfect. This is the Stoke City that Michael O'Neill wants to see. Lucas and Reyes lost it. And the chance is gobbled up. Lee Gregory pounces. Yeah, there's obviously a sense of relief. Um, delighted with the three points today against a very, very good team. But we're not celebrating, you know. We're not in a situation. We're relieved that we've stayed up. It was a difficult situation we inherited at the club. Um, but the work starts now to make sure that obviously this doesn't happen going forward. Fletcher gives it back to McLean. Great chance, and it's in. Jacob Brown for Stoke City. Stoke corner. And there are plenty forward for it too. And there's Vokes, who opens the goal scoring with 26 minutes gone. Campbell with a lovely little back flick. Not cleared away. Powell, 2-0 Stoke. It's a free header and a simple goal for Steve Fletcher to put Stoke in front. This is Therese Campbell, who's been impressive so far, had a hand in both goals, went for goal himself and helps himself to a third. Yeah, there is Nevis, almost a present, fighting by Campbell! It will be a happy anniversary for Michael O'Neill. Finally, obviously, it's a year on since you walked through the door. Considering where you were when you came to where you yeah. are now, you must be pleased yeah. with the progress. Yeah, I am. Yeah, I am. It's, it's been uh, challenging, but it's been good. A lot of hard work. The staff have done brilliant work behind the scenes as well. Made a lot of changes with the club, which I think 
hopefully will benefit the club in the long term as well. And uh, we just got to keep you know working away. Progression um, is, is important for the club. We've, we've done it, I think, with you know quite limited resources, and we just got to continue to do that and, and make sure that you know the players we bring to the club are the right type and, and, and add to the squad that we have.